So today I want to show a video um, about how to remove leftover plasti discs. See, if you're like me, you don't read instructions, and I plasti dipped my wheels uh, flat black. Well, I didn't do it thick enough. Um, I only did a couple coats, which they, they apparently on the bottom tell you to do several. So now for the past six months, I've been trying to get the plasti dip off my wheels. I've used every cleaner imaginable, everything, and you can see up in here, there is still tons of, of it. It's like when the wheel heats up, it melts, and then just comes right back from like behind the wheels and stuff. It's just, I mean, it, it has been a nightmare. It's made the wheels look horrible for for a long time. So today, I went and got a little bit of uh, Neverdale. I'm sure you guys have heard of it. It's a wadding polish. It's got some, uh, some special stuff on it. And uh, I've used everything imaginable, other than just taking like a wire brush, you know. Um, but never dull. Unfortunately, you can see there's all that that black right there. Never dull. Like melts it. the weirdest thing. I mean, like I said, I've used everything. And Goof Off, they make a plastic dip spray that gets it off, and it's pretty much just Goof Off. It's like citrus. And so, as you can see, a little bit of elbow grease. Really get up in there. It actually, you can you can kind of like feel it when you're doing it. It actually, I hope the camera doesn't just go sideways there on you. Anyway, the the never dull just actually kind of melts it away. Look at that, it's gone. There's no more plastic dip on that that bottom of the wheel. Like I said, you gotta you gotta give a little little bit of elbow grease, but it's not bad at all. It just dissolves the. Uh, See that? All that stuff right there? That's all looks like plastic. Just and it just keeps coming back and back and back. But, uh, take a little bit of Voila. Completely gone. So, this is the uh, best trick I've learned yet for uh, getting rid of it and uh, get the stuff off because it's just it's a pain in the ass. Never plastic dip your wheels. There's another one right here. Um, just, just don't bother. Unless you're going to buy like six or seven, eight, nine cans of it and put on like a thick ass layer. Because other than that, it does not just peel off. Let me be the bearer of bad news. It does not just peel off. Absolutely not. It comes off in 16 inch pieces. So, that is, uh, that is my new little exploration for the day. That uh, never go, we'll take it all off. So, um, I'll show you one more time. So this is the stuff. If you've got plasti dip all over your wheels and you can't get it off, or anything else for that matter, uh, this is the stuff. It literally just dissolves the uh, plasti dip and makes it go away. Here's the corner I'm working on. And so how Neverdull works is you, you wipe it on and you see how everything's all dull. Uh, you let it dry and it dries to a haze and then you wipe it off. And not only does it get rid of the plastic dip, but it really, really helps polish up your, your chrome, take out little scratches and stuff. And uh, it really, really does a great job polishing. I mean, Neverdull is a... And I'm not paid by them or any weird shit like that. Uh, I just love this stuff. You know, it gets dirt off, scratches, light rust. It'll take light rust right off. See if it's a whole grill. I haven't wiped it off yet. But uh, light rust, everything, it'll take it right off. This stuff is a, is a See, here's what it looks like when it dries. This wheel was covered in plastic. I mean, it splatters everywhere. So, um, 
Yep, just a little tip. Uh, if you like it, it's cool. Uh, what does it say? Subscribe, share, and all that shit stuff. So that is uh, Never Dull. Hope you like it.